are going to be drawing the first angle orthographic projection of the block on the screen. So we have drawn our borders, which is our vertical and horizontal line, with one one centimeter border each on the right and left hand side of them. So first of all, we'll pick our um, our ruler. As we can see in the block, thirty five. 35 millimeter i'll pick 35 millimeter to the top like this then i can also see that there is a circle of thickness of 12 millimeter so 12 millimeter i'll pick 12 millimeter like this that's 1.2 centimeter so let's draw that out first our 12 millimeter let's draw that out please make sure you are using thin thin lines we will thicken them later we have gotten what we want to get so we can also see that we have a very straight line which is 60 millimeter which is a straight hollow and the hollow is having a diameter of 20 millimeter so the diameter is coming the 20 millimeter is coming here and we have this place to be 35 so definitely for it to be at the center 35 minus 20 which is going to be 15 then 15 divided by 2 is going to be 7.5. So I'm going to be picking 0.75 centimeter from each edge like this. Then I'll pick another 0.75 from this particular place. So using those line I pick, I'll draw a straight line like this. And another straight line like this. Like this. So we, are, we have been told that it's 60 millimeter, which is the length. So I'll pick my 60 like this and draw my, my straight line like this. On that point of 60 millimeter. Now I'll be thickening it out like this. So we'll take this place out like this, like this. this so we have taken it out already now we are going to be projecting our lines downward to draw our plan or top view whichever one you will call it i'll call it the plan for the purpose of this video so i'll project this place downward and i'll project this place downward as we can see the diagram above show us that the plan and the front view are going to be exactly the same thing. Now, I'll pick my 35 millimeter here also, as we have done in the first one. Pick my 35 millimeter. So, I'll use my ruler like this. I'll join here. Then, the same way we did, in which we pick 7.5 millimeter, that's 0.75. We are going to do the same too in the second one 0.75 and 0.75 that's for the plan so we'll draw a straight line like this then draw another one like this this is actually our front our front view and this is our plan so we are going to taking it out now at the end of this you will actually see that it is the same Please, if you are finding value in this video, please kindly subscribe to get more of our videos and turn on the notification button to be the first. So, we have drawn our plan already. We'll join this also. We'll join this also. So, this is our plan. In order to draw the side view, we are going to control angle 45 degree from the center of this two points the vertical and horizontal line we drew at first we'll draw our 45 degree now project all lines to the angle 45 degree all lines that are coming from the plan to the angle 45 degree like this like this so now i'm going to be projecting them upward I'm going to project those lines upward like this like this and 
like this so now we are going to be projecting line from the front view towards our right hand side like this towards the side of the make sure they are tinting lines please make sure they are tinting lines now from the diagram we have seen we have seen that the, our side view is actually going to be a circle because we can actually see circles in this drawing so in order to draw that we are going to find the center of this particular mid circle first we are going to be finding the center and we have been given this one as two centimeter that is the diameter of the smaller circle there this two centimeter so we'll pick our one centimeter here and this one is also two centimeter we'll pick our one centimeter so using empty long chains which are thin thin lines please we'll draw like this and we'll also draw another line like this that is to get to the center at which we are going to draw our circle from so now that i've gotten the center at which i'm going to draw my circle from i'll place it at the center then to the edge then then i'll draw my circle i can thicken it out directly like this like this so now to draw the bigger circle place it at the same center also it's going to be actually the same center for the larger circle so i'll draw my circle like this like this let me thicken it out like this so be dimensioning it also thanks for watching